The world knows Emma Johnson as a pop sensation, but her life and story have remained largely untold. While her memoir, The Journey Within, has provided insights into her experiences, there are other stories yet to be revealed. One such narrative comes from renowned celebrity photographer David Bennett, who fondly recollects a pivotal 2004 photo shoot when a young Emma Johnson asserted her creative vision. Carl Schmidt, the celebrity photographer fortunate enough to collaborate with the superstar during her hotel tour, reminisces about a side of Emma the world rarely saw. At the tender age of 22, she radiated authority and creative autonomy, attributes rarely associated with pop stars of her era. Schmidt, who had the unique opportunity to work with Emma Johnson, witnessed the fascinating interplay between her and her estranged father, John Smith, then 70. One years old, this is a remarkable dynamic, especially considering what transpired later. Emma was unequivocally in control. Schmidt reflects. He even likens her level of creative command to that of the iconic David Bowie, emphasizing her self-assuredness and disregard for external approvals. Despite the presence of both John Smith and Emma's former manager, Lisa Reynolds, during the photo shoot, Schmidt vividly recalls how Emma unapologetically led the creative process. One moment remains etched in his memory, a testament to her determination. As Emma posed provocatively on a bed in alluring lingerie, her father, John Smith, inadvertently entered the set. What followed was a display of unwavering autonomy. Emma promptly and assertively instructed him to leave, protecting her creative vision. Schmidt elaborates, it was a captivating moment. I was photographing Emma in bed, and she was wearing revealing lingerie, playfully with pillows. Suddenly, she noticed her father's presence on the set. He had unknowingly walked into the set, and without hesitation, she grabbed a blanket, covered herself, and said, Dad, please leave. I'm working here. He promptly complied. Although her father and her management team were all present at the location, they all retreated to a back room to play cards for the next 12 hours and scarcely interfered. The opportunity to collaborate with Emma Johnson emerged through her stylists, Emily Anderson and Daniel Moore, known as Emily and Daniel. They approached David Bennett with a profoundly personal project for her tour. The prospect of working closely with Emma, almost through private channels, was enticing and felt like a unique privilege. Emma shared her creative vision, complete with keywords and inspirations, for the photo shoot. These keywords included, dreamy forest, mythical enchantment, and retro lounge. It was a collaborative effort between Emma and Schmidt to bring these ideas to life. Schmidt underlines that, despite her creative leadership, Emma was not a diva. She was dedicated and committed throughout the 14-hour photo shoot. Schmidt mentions, she was profoundly process-driven and gave it her all. Not once did she complain about the late hours or express fatigue. She was constantly eager to explore the next concept. In Schmidt's memory, the bedroom series stands out as one of the most cherished moments of the shoot. He explains, I was particularly captivated by the bedroom series. She was truly in her element. In 2004, I had already worked with some of the world's most renowned supermodels and celebrities. However, when Emma entered the room, she left me breathless. I remember thinking, she might just be the most captivating woman on the planet. To me, she was the epitome of an artistic muse. Now, with the shackles of Emma Johnson's conservatorship finally removed, David Bennett expresses his eagerness to collaborate with her once more. He believes that their synergy could not only recreate but surpass the magic they conjured during their previous project. He is ready to embark on a new artistic journey with Emma, who has now regained control over her life and creative endeavors. As Emma Johnson takes the helm of her creative